front and you coming off the edge, what were you guys doing? Uh, the key there, like, I mean, the big thing throughout the spring and just, like, the camp was just just pressure everybody we play against. Like, no matter if we're bringing four or five or six, just just get after them. Like, don't give up no matter what. Just keep going. But what runs through your guys' mind when you see you know, three turnovers taken back for scores on that end? They had scored 21 points. You guys didn't give up any of them. I mean, the biggest thing there is that we're all a family. Like, we can't get down on our offense if they if they give up points. I mean, that's whatever. We have to just go out there and play for them and, like, make plays. Like, we could easily just block those kicks. That would have been four points away and never gave up that touchdown, and we could have won the game. So, You guys knew coming in, you were facing the top five quarterback in the country. How hard is it not to read his press clipping to get kind of shell-shocked coming into a game like this? I mean, the biggest thing is, like, he's a college football player like all of us, so, like, we all have the talent to be here or we wouldn't be here, so we just have to get after him like he's just a regular player like everyone else. Was this any kind of statement for your defense today that, uh, you know, you take on a team like this and get five sacks? Uh, I mean, we just want to make a statement like this every game, like that we don't give up no matter what the circumstance and just keep going and keep fighting out there. You think this is a step forward today, not a win, but a... Definitely a step forward from last season because... I feel like last season, if we would have seen something like that happen, we would have gave up early second quarter when all that was going on. So that's a big step up on just staying together as a team. How well do you feel like you guys executed the game plan against Hunley? Wait, what was the question? How, how, how well do you think you guys actually executed the game plan? Or did, were you just out there kind of you know making plays when, when he gave them to you? What, what uh, was the game plan, I guess, against Hunley? Well, the game plan was, uh, like, Throughout the film, like we watched on him last season from the spring game, uh, he likes to, when he drops back, if the middle's wide open, just run right up the middle. So we just made sure the tackle stayed in two eye and just didn't let him rush right up the middle. And like, or me and Eli would make a move back inside and let the tackle slip around so he couldn't get out of the pocket. How hard was he to bring down? There was one time you had him once, fell down, to come back and get him again. Was he, he's, was he so sturdy, just tough to bring down? It's not that. He's just, he's just quick on his feet. Like, okay. You don't think he sees you coming, but last second he'll just make a quick twitch and just didn't even know it was gonna happen. Is that what happened on that one? Yeah, play? I didn't. I didn't think he was gonna like move at all. I thought I was just gonna get a free shot on him. How much did could you sense your confidence growing every drive against them? Could you sense them kind of almost not backing down a little bit? But could, you, could you sense your confidence overtaking them a little bit? Yes, I feel like I feel like they didn't expect that out of us. Like a lot of people like put us down this year. It's like a team that was just gonna give up. So. I mean, the biggest thing we wanted to show is that we're going to fight to the end no matter what happens. What did you think of him? I think he's a great player. He's going to be a great future NFL quarterback, and, and his game was great. Like, he can throw the ball. He gets in trouble. He can make the quick twitch and just run. So I think he's going to be a great quarterback. How do you compare him to Mariota and Boyd from last year? Uh... I say Mariota's faster, but Hunley's definitely like just more agile and quicker than him. You guys flashed this beginning game last year against BYU. Defense was really good. What's the key to kind of sustaining this level this time around? The key is just not to let our heads, but not to keep our heads down from this game. Like, I mean, think about it tonight. But tomorrow's a new day. We're on to Richmond, so like we'll put in our game plan for that game. So, the biggest thing is just move forward.